everybody, I'm Heather from the Nocatee Welcome Center and guess what? You recognize him, Adrian Shepard of David Weekly Homes and we are back in Settlers Landing and he's got another ready to move in house, ready for you today. So I can't wait for him to show you this beautiful home in Settlers Landing. Thanks again for having us. Oh, you're very welcome. Thank you for coming. So here we are at 413 Sawyer Bridge Trail and this home is 2,569 square feet. It's five bedrooms and four bathrooms. And come on in and look at this beautiful home. And I want to remind people that um, this particular home is on the end of a cul-de-sac. So you do have a cul-de-sac area. It's great if you have kids, a safe area. So I can't wait for you to see the location on the site map. And you can find our site maps on Nocatee.com, clicking on the Neighborhood tab. So look at this front bedroom. This room is ideal as a study. So uh, you could have either five bedrooms or four bedrooms plus this room as a study. And it does have a full bathroom attached to it. I love this, Adrian, that your company put a full bath right here because if you are working from home, but let's say you are getting up super early, you don't want to wake up the rest of the home, I like that you have this shower option in here. Also, if you're coming back from one of the many pools, this could also be an area like, let's clean everybody up before they run around the house. You're right. Flexibility is the name of the game. Absolutely. And Carling, if you'll look over here, great little drop zone. And how big is the garage, Adrian? It's a two-car garage, but it does have an eight-foot garage door, and the garage has also been extended by three feet. Oh, that's terrific. So you can put your golf cart in that space, or storage. You can be storing your kayak, canoe, paddleboard. Now look at that laundry room. Everyone knows I love a laundry room, and I can promise you this is a huge laundry room. So again, we're towards the front of the house. You've got a great coat closet right oh. here for your guests. Or again, to store, you know, rain gear. It's not raining though, it never rains in Nocatee. We say we have the force field over us. And look at these sight lines, all the way from the front door, through the home to the outside, and the preserve beyond. That's a beautiful view. And the location of the windows is just breathtaking. The natural light that comes it, through here is, is just so, so invigorating. It's really nice. And I love the colors that y'all chose for this kitchen. Notice you've got a contrast between the cabinets on the center island and those on the perimeter. And those lovely blue uh, pieces of tape that you see on the cabin trees just to indicate that there's still some work to be attended to before the home is completed for the eventual family that moves in. And look at all this space, Carly. Can you get this in between? So you're cooking over here, but look at the space here. I'll open this dishwasher just so you see plenty of room so I do like the placement of this island if you are entertaining friends and Adrian pointed out these are soft closed drawers so that's always a nice feature and then of course more drawers under the gas range and reminding people Settlers Landing is a gas community yep no pipe no buried tanks in Settlers Landing everything is piped in underground Love the cabinets to the ceiling too. Just lots of storage. And then Carlin, look around and see where Adrian's standing. He's standing on your table. Just <laughs> kidding. Imaginary table. But again, look at your view out here. This has to be a popular floor plan, Adrian, because this is amazing. I just love all the natural. We've lighting. had a lot of very positive comments on yes. this floor plan. Um, such wonderful natural light filtering through here, as you can see. And wait till we get outside and you see how special this home site is backing up to preserve. And that's the thing for even the quick move in you showed us last week to this one right now. Look at your spectacular view on the preserve. And you know what's behind you. You'll just be seeing nature. This preserve actually backs up to the area where you'll find Settler's Pond, the lake that's 14 acres stocked with seven varieties of fish that has a fishing dock, a kayak launch, and a huge covered pavilion. Have you gone out there fishing yet? I haven't, but I've photographed a family that has. I love that, I love that. Yes, Settler's Pond has really been a favorite for those people moving into Settler's Landing, but I will remind you that it is available to anyone in Nocatee, but if you live here, you literally are right down the road. This particular home site 
is in walking distance. So that's something that's great. I also want to remind people that Pine Island Academy, if you have a kindergartner through eighth grader, that would be your K-8 school. And you can golf cart your kids around Settlers Pond to the golf cart parking across from the school. Super cool. If you like to run or jog, yeah. the, the path is actually a mile round. Just round a mile so so you and I, Adrian, need to do a video. We'll just attempt to run around it, but we'll probably only make it a quarter. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be happy to do the filming. You do the running. Yeah, I was like, I don't know, I don't know. But I love that, a one mile pond. Okay, so this, again, this is gonna be your owner's suite. And look at your view. And wait till you see the bathroom. I do love it. I love the cabinets. I love the hardware. All right, let's check. Come on in, come on in. Look at the double sinks. Absolutely beautiful. And I, I like the walk down, one little step shower. But wait till you see the closet. So you know how a lot of times you have the storage under the stairs and it's just a separate area. Well, guess what? You as the owner, you get the Harry Potter space. But just even more storage, Carling, if when you show this, if you'll go around the corner, because it is super cool. So lots and lots of storage in this uh, first floor, wonderful closet. Adrian, are you going in the shower again? I just wanted to take a look <laughs> at the recessed niche that's in here as well. So you don't have to have all your shampoos on display on the shelf there uh, and you can nice. have them hidden a lot of great attention to detail that david weekly homes put in this particular home but yeah, i think you do it for all your quick move-ins so we were talking about when i asked adrian about the garage and he said that there's an extension to that garage we mentioned yes you can store your golf cart because nocatee is a golf cart friendly community but also your kayak canoe paddle boards I mention those because Settlers Landing is very close to a wonderful kayak canoe paddleboard launch called the Paddle Launch at the Nocatee Landing. And what that is, that's your intracoastal waterway access point. So if you wanna fish, not in the pond in your neighborhood, but you wanna fish in the intracoastal, you will have access to that. You can take your golf cart there. And that has been just a beloved area for Nocatee residents. And again, so close to Settlers Landing. Now I have fished there. Have you? And successfully so too. Yeah, it's a very popular fishing site. So now we're upstairs and we've gone to the right hand side. This particular room I love, I said favorite child room because it does have a full bath within it. But if you don't need this space for, let's say, a child in your house, this would be a great space for a guest because, again, they have their own private bathroom and there is storage closet. Very nice. Love that. Okay, Adrian, what's on the other side? Well, on the other side of this loft area, which is a nice space if you had children that just wanted to have an area where they could do their homework or sit down and watch TV, perhaps, you have two bedrooms, and there's one other bathroom up here as well. I do like this loft space. I think this is a great space, whether you're gonna play in it, hang out in it, I just, or just a sitting area. So another great bedroom. This is even a little bit larger, so I do love this secondary bedroom. And Carly, if you'll peek into the full bath. Yep. That's gonna be right Very here. Nice. So I do like, again, a dual vanity. I really like the hardware that y'all picked out. Oh, yes. Okay, this room is huge. In a way, we would say this is favorite child room. But what's going on, Adrian? Well, this, this room could actually be a game room as well if you didn't need it as a bedroom because you have the other bedroom downstairs. But um, we, we conduct lots of tests um, with our homes. And uh, Jacksonville Business Science is, of course, a scientific test that we do to ensure the energy efficiency of our homes. Uh, we guarantee the kilowatt hours and firms used to make the home energy efficient, comfortable, and also very economical to run. But there is one test um, that's not scientific that I'd like to conduct here. And I haven't seen many builders do this, um, but it's the Papa and Children test. And um, if I just get down here, <laughs> 
This is uh, underneath here, there's an eight pound pad and an upgraded shawl carpet. But I've seen children who are very savvy buyers um, conduct this test and I wondered about it, so I thought I'd do it myself. Um, <laughs> Wow. I don't think we've ever seen this on video um, in all the years. <laughs> and I can tell you that uh, my grandchildren, Adriana, Charles, and Zander, would definitely give it the thumbs up. It passes. Um, I and, love that test. But for anyone who may be alarmed, let me assure you that no carpet fibers were harmed <laughs> in the making of this video. Thank you, Adrian. I think you've uh, set the bar very high for future site agents uh, when we do videos. Okay, now I have to just say, I love this closet. You're like, why does Heather like this closet? Because you've got a secret door. Now that goes to your attic access. So again, instead of having the traditional attic as we all know it in the garage, a great attic space that you could just quickly walk out to store your holiday items, whatever you need to store. I absolutely love that location. And like Adrian said, this space that he of course did his uh, role in, that is a giant room that you could make in a movie room. You can, again, how the windows are with the wall. You can make it a great gaming room with a pool table. So there's so many options. This particular floor plan is outstanding by David Weekly Homes. And you've got some great incentives for this house. We do. We have a $25,000 incentive that can be applied either off the price or towards closing costs or rate buy down. So give me a call, come and see me, and I'd be very happy to discuss it further with you. All right, Adrian's phone's gonna start ringing immediately. So David Weekly Homes, Settlers Landing, we're on Sawyer Bridge Trail, cannot wait for you to buy this house. And thank you again, Adrian. It's my pleasure. Thanks thank for you. watching. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.